or what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to this Brooklyn Bulls expansion. It is actually not expansion. Relocation franchise, whatever you want to call it. In the first episode of... Well, last episode, not the first episode. In the last episode of the new season debut, we defeated the Patriots 49 to, I think it was 17, right? To 17. We completely dominated... Justin Fields had a great game in his second year. 287 yards and three touchdowns rushing-wise. Marlon Mack also dominated with four touchdowns. Receiving-wise was all David Njoku, who I did change his number to number 86, so he would not be 46 no more. Anyways, we're going to sim, I want to say, all the way to this Bengals game we might be simming to. So let me see our team schedule and see if we should sim to the Bengals game. Um, yeah, I mean, these other games beforehand, they're tough, but I think I want to sit to this primetime game Thursday Night Football against the Bengals. And we'll see. I mean, there's not really any big games after that, so maybe we'll play maybe the Browns or Ravens? Because after this Bengals game, there's, like, no big games besides the Bills. Um... Yeah, ooh, see, now this is a predicament. I don't know if I want to face the Browns or the Bengals. I want to get to the season relatively quick, so we're going to go up against the Bengals, and we're going to sim all the way to week five. So, answer media question. I guess I got a media question. Many folks, including yourself, thought this team would perform better last season. How do you avoid that? Um, We start by forgetting last season. Okay. I, I think we were going to make the playoffs. Um, if you guys are new here, by the way, subscribe. Um, I make... I was going to say, I, I'm so used to saying I'm going to make NBA content every single day, but I don't do that. I've been posting every other day for about the past two months, something like that. Um, view, just subscribe. I can't speak. Marlon Mack won Offensive Player of the Week. We're going up against the Green Bay Packers and Aaron Rodgers. We're going to simulate this week, and hopefully we can get a win. And we lose by 14. Sick. Okay. Didn't expect that. Um, we have some players to re-sign. Rodney Hudson, he only wants one year. He's a 91 overall. I'm going to give it to him. It's probably going to be his final year in the league. Um, Okay, never mind. He didn't accept it. Okay, then. Um, Ellington Jenkins, definitely want to re-sign him. Uh, Ellington? No. El, El, I'm not saying his name. Um, we'll give him about 5.10 mil signing bonus. We'll give him about 7.5 salary. He should accept that. Okay, so we got Jenkins back. And then next week, we got to re-sign Quinn Williams. He's probably the biggest free agent we need to re-sign. I'm not sure how his development is in um, Madden 21, but hopefully it's not bad. Um, okay, we're going to auto that. And hopefully we can win against the Browns. So let's see. Can we beat the 1-1 one one Browns? This We kind of need this win here, and we lose by 10. Oh, my goodness. 1-2, and, and we're winning the division at 1-2. Okay, all right. That that we lost these two games by double digits. It's not looking good to start the season, but we're still le leading the division somehow. Those were two very rough games. We're gonna have a third rough game here against the Baltimore Ravens. So we have a tough schedule. We do indeed have a tough schedule. We're gonna try and bring back Hudson. I mean, I have unlimited cap room because the cap in this game is broken. So we'll just give him whatever the hell he wants. I'm happy. Okay, so Rodney Hudson is back. We're going to re-sign Quinn Williams, our star player. We want you long-term. So I'm going to make a seven-year deal, give him as much money as he wants. Uh, whatever he wants, I don't care. I have unlimited cap because this game's broken. There we go. We get Quinn Williams back on a seven-year deal. And we're going to sim against the Ravens, and hopefully we can actually win. But we're going to upgrade players first. Um, no one I'm going to manually upgrade. I'm just going to do it normally. So let's see if we can beat the Ravens. Fred Warner is back. I forgot that we didn't even have him. Our highest rated player, our biggest free agent signing. Fred Warner is back. Maybe he, maybe he was the missing piece. Maybe he's why we were losing. Let's see if we can get a win over the one and two Ravens, please. We lost by we lost by one. Why I don't? Why am I? Why does it say start relocating? Why would I relocate again? I'm I'm already. That's weird. I'm just going to ignore that. I, don't, I didn't relocate at all. Um, there's no reason for this team to relocate. But we are 1-3. We need this win. We do need this win. So let's jump into this game against the Bengals. All right, here we go. We get the ball to start off this game. 
We're one and three on the season. We want to be a lot better. I'm going to dip off. Dip off? That's not why I meant to say two. I think that's A.B. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's Antonio Brown. Give the ball to him for the first play. We're going to actually run on second down. This Bengals team is 3-1. and one. We're currently at home for Thursday Night Football. We we kind of need this win here. to have. If we go to 1-4, and four, it's going to be so difficult to make the playoffs. All right, we got an early third down here. We're going to run post routes. Right now, A.B. is my number one target for this play. And he's going to get open. Antonio Brown, he doesn't have the speed because he's like 33 years old, but he gets that completion. All right, we got a third and three here. This is an interesting play that I don't really like that much. So I'm going to put Hill on a slant. And Njoku is going to be wide open. And he drops it. Yeah, there's no way I'm punting. This close to the red zone. Well, not really the red zone. But you know what I mean. This close to field goal range. I'm not punting this ball. There's no way in hell. And Marlon Mack is going to get the first down. And a lot more. Bringing us all the way to the 27. Situations like that, you have to go for it. All right, we got first and 10 here. And Joku is the route I'm looking at. And no one is open. I'm going to give it up to Crowd. And it gets deflected. I don't know why. Just throw it to him straight. He's standing still. Just throw it to him. Second and 10. Looking for something on offense, you know. Anything. <laughs> Literally anything. Um, I got hit. I moved. That was my fault. Third and 10 here. This Bengals defense is... Kind of ripping us apart in the passing game. Let's see if we can do anything. I see Jamison Crowder. He's going to get that high catch for the first down. First and goal. Another post route. And AB is my primary target. Let's see if he can get open. He's going to get open. Antonio Brown in the end zone for the first touchdown of the game. 33-year-old, 77 overall. Antonio Brown scoring the first TD. Sadly, the Bengals went right down the field and scored immediately. So, that sucks. Anyway, he's going to run a Marlon Mack run here, and we're going to get a solid five yards. Oh, AB. He's running. Oh, that's not going to be a good play. Yeah. That could have been pass interference, but he doesn't have the speed. Like, he was getting pressed. He has no speed to beat that corner. So, that's sad. That could have been a big play. I'm going to give it up to Njoku. I could have rack catched it, but, you know... Might as well possession catch. Alright, Kylan Hill just got us a first and ten. And look at that. Okay, so... The corner's pressing with not much free safety help. Can he... Please, St. Brown. He catches it. Big play from the sophomore St. Brown. I don't know how to say his first name. It's like a Moray or something like that. But he didn't have much safety help there. I'm going to actually run with Kylan Hill. I see a, a slight gap there. But that free safety might push in. And the middle linebacker actually did. And we go like nowhere. It's going to be the end of the first quarter anyways. All right. We got second and goal here. Run good old slant for Jamison Crowder. Oh, Jamison Crowder right through the middle. That's another touchdown. We scored back-to-back -back drives. When I'm playing, this offense is good. <laughs> and our defense comes up clutch and stops the Bengals. Our offense hasn't even been that bad this season. We... Been putting up like 20 plus points in all of our games. As Marlon Mack avoids the defender but only goes three yards. He's having a pretty bad game. Alright, we've already got a third and seven. Two rushing plays went absolutely nowhere. I'd like to convert here. I'm going to give it... Why was that pass so high? Oh, that's our first drive of, you know, a punt. The Bengals ended up scoring a touchdown. Our defense... Did not hold them to at least a field goal like I was hoping. Yeah, I like our our O line is really failing me right now. Second and ten. This O I know the Bengals have a solid defense at least in Madden, but this O line's got to do better. Jamison Crowder with the catch. First and ten, looking for Antonio Brown on this post route. He's just the main target today, apparently. Antonio Brown, you see, he sadly doesn't have the speed. But he gets us the first down. He's having a pretty big game today. Got another first and 10. And Joku, once again, is, I'm going to put Crowder on a streak. I'm not sure if that middle linebacker is going to help. He did. And Joku runs. Ah, uh, that was just a bad pass. And hopefully he doesn't get a pick six here. He's not going to. Wow, that just did not go well. 
Our defense does come in clutch, though, with the stop. It's just the fact of, can we go down to get at least field goal range? And this time, and Waddle's going to get us started, giving us, getting us to the 36. First and 10, 49 seconds left. Looking to, I want to at least get into field goal range. At least get into field goal range. I'm going to give it to Jamison Crowder. What? that? Okay, that play is just glitched at this point. Like, the pass always goes too high. Of course, Madden would be broken. Oh, here we go. Let's try this again. I'm going to wait. Waddell, he's going to cross, and he might have the speed to go all the way. This is going to be a touchdown. We're going to take a 20-14 to 14 lead. They have Dante Hightower? Interesting. How do we allow them to, How do we let them score in 30 seconds? Is this defense really that bad? Our trade's going to have to be made. How did we let them score that quick? Okay. Jamison Crowder. There's one second left. He might be in field goal range. How, I don't understand how he let them score that quick. Are we in field goal range at least? I don't care about move the chains. I want to know if we're in field goal range. Apparently not. It didn't even let me. Why are we running Hail Mary? No. This game is so annoying sometimes. I'm definitely not running a Hail Mary there. I'll run a post route. This has more success, even though it's broken. Like, we're not going to end up scoring here. But we can get some plays. Jameson. I, I hate this game. Well, the Bengals end up scoring a field goal. Two interceptions so far in this game. Our defense has been complete ass cheeks. Waddell playing great in that slot position. All right, we got first and 10 here, and we're at the 21. This play looks like it might work, actually. They don't have much in the backfield. David Njoku, he has the speed in the end zone. Touchdown. Defense, please do something. Our defense at least held them to a field goal, so I'll take it. But they are very, very disappointing. I knew they were not that bright of a spot for this team, but I didn't think. Why is there is there a flat? Why is the timeout yellow? Um, that okay. Um, that was interesting. I don't know why a timeout was called. I ran right into the alignment. Oh, Marlon Mack tore his labrum. That's why. Sick. All right, that's uh, there goes our starting running back down. He wasn't playing well, but that doesn't matter. I guess Kylan Hill's gonna get a majority of the carries, even though he's been able to do nothing on the ground. Oh, 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 that's the two-yard line. All right, we're currently at the two-yard line. Okay, I, we just ran the ball, did it very successfully, and we're going to get a touchdown here. Jamison Crowder in the end zone. Defense, please, no touchdown. If you give one up, don't give up a two-point conversion. Well, guess what happened? They gave up a touchdown and a two-point conversion. This is... Oh, yeah, yeah. This defense is playing awful. This defense is playing awful. At this point, I'm just scared to give the Bengals the ball. Seeing just how good the offense has been this game. It, it's just sad. Now we got a third down and not a very good play call. What the hell is this? What is this play? This may not work. I don't know what this play is. Um, I'm banking on it. Oh, what hell? Got it. Almost 400 yards for Justin Fields and he has five touchdowns. We got third down and three here. Big play. I guess I'm passing it. Oh, whoever number 41 is. Whitlow, Whitlow. I don't know who you are, but you just got probably the biggest first down of the game. We got third down and three, but we've, we've lowered the clock to about a minute and a half, so that's good. We just need a first down here. First, I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong effing button. It was triangle that... Oh, my goodness. Fourth and three. I'm not punting. We're not even in field goal range? I didn't even know we weren't in field goal range. Oh my god, this is, uh, this is a huge play now. Kylan Hill. He didn't get it. He didn't get it. 
And our defense once again screws it over for us. How? This defense is awful. This defense is god awful. They allowed the Bengals to drop 42 points. Justin Fields can't throw this far. And it's picked off. Yep. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, this, this defense. I am making trades next time. This defense was ass. End of the game. Our defense allowed Joe Burrow to throw for 400 yards and three touchdowns on 68%. That's just on. That's just, there's no. Our secondary is the issue, is what I'm hearing. Our secondary is the issue. That was just sad. That was a disgusting. Whoever this dude is got two touchdowns. Gerald Everett had 100 yards. This defense was disgust, Was awful. Awful. Absolutely awful. Unfreaking believable. We got one sack on the game. Leave like you guys did enjoy. I'm about to trade. I feel like trading this entire defense. They played awful.